Association of Professional Women Engineers of Nigeria, a division of the Nigeria Engineering Society, organized a one-day workshop for girls in the junior secondary school. The president of the association, Fumilola Ojelade, says the aim of this workshop is to inspire the girls at this current level to study and practice engineering profession. Program is simply to inspire girls to take up STEM careers. STEM in this case means, can anyone tell me what STEM means? Okay, I would like someone to stand up and come to the mic boldly. Come to the microphone boldly. Okay. Science, technology, engineering, mathematics. Oh, please clap for her. Okay, so I'm sure that we already have people, girls that will take. She also emphasized that fewer women are in the engineering sector, which is one of the reasons they are catching the girls young to increase their love for the profession. Well, STEM careers in this place. So, as she has said, STEM means science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. But do you know the um, association that is holding this program today? Do you know what we are called? Okay, I want somebody to tell me that also. Please come. The association also organized a competition among the girls with the winner giving a grand prize of a science kit which will help boost their knowledge on the profession as engineers are problem solvers. Uh, the number one mission of APWEN, that is the Association of Professional Women Engineers of Nigeria, our number one mission is to increase the numerical strength of women practicing engineering because we are few when compared to the men and the only way we can do it is to take them from this young young first and foremost um to be in that kind of position the only female in the reconstruction high powered committee on reconstruction of 500 housing units i'm also one of the females doing bridges in Medjugorje. Uh, uh, presently i'm in, on the team of um, custom flyover is the first flyover in northeast of Nigeria. So, um, first and foremost, uh, females, since we are not given, you know, we are still not getting this 50 50 thing, we have to show ourselves by working very hard. Uh, let our integrity, we should be morally upright, our integrity should be intact, do have what it's meant to be on that field, on our fingertips. You can't be lazy and be in this profession. You, you still stay on my word. I want to be an aerospace engineer. Like I said before, I want to become it because of I want to know much about the moon. My name is uh, Engineer Dr. Robinson Ejila. Yeah, the immediate uh, or the former national chairman of Nigerian Institution of Mechanical Engineers. Uh, and I also double as uh, the APOM She Engineer Diversity and Inclusion Ambassador. Yeah. Mm. Yes. Um, workshops of this nature have uh, a tremendous, usually make. Uh, a huge and tremendous impact in terms of advocacy. Uh, advocacy uh, in a manner that will inspire young minds uh, to achieve great things as they grow, in a, in a manner to shape young minds to be on the right track in terms of uh, development, in terms of progress, and in terms of uh, uh, the realization of the uh, their dreams and aspirations as they grow up in their professional lives. So this uh, workshop has a great role to play, especially when it has to do when it has to do with uh, a role modeling. Uh, you know, younger minds to a large extent learn from imitating uh, the 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 older persons 
who more or, more or less play the role of, of role models or role models and uh, so the impact in terms of role modeling here is going to be very huge because they see them as standards they, they want to shape themselves and aspire uh, to grow up to be like so that is the role they have to play Yes, of course, uh, the advice are numerous. First, uh, I would like to urge them uh, to be hardworking, to read, because uh, a leader is a reader. You cannot lead when you don't have new ideas, or you, are not, you don't have the capacity to generate ideas, to solve real, prime, uh, real life problems. So they should read very hard, ensure that uh, they pass the exams, they do well with their grades, uh, they should not, of course, uh, interact with uh, wrong characters, uh, have the right moral framework, uh, grow up with the right moral frame of mind, and at the same time to be committed towards building their country in whichever direction they find themselves or in whichever endeavor eventually they engage themselves. So I think uh, uh, if they stay focused, they work hard, they aspire to be like their role models here today. Uh, the, the, uh, the sky certainly is going to be their limits. Yeah. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you.